the public market is packing up and moving. Juan and Maria's empanada stop served its last meal at its current location. But don't worry, you won't have to go far for one of their delicious empanadas. Bobby Padilla has been coming here to the Rochester public market for more than a decade. The one thing that keeps him coming back... Sometimes a little early, sometimes a little late, but I had always started here at Juan and Maria's. Like, that was our incentive to actually getting the kids out of bed was we're going to get empanadas. For 17 years, Juan Contreras and his wife Maria have been serving up their delicious empanadas out of this turquoise building. The public market was the, was the boom. That's when we started selling 20 empanadas on a Saturday, 100 empanadas on a Saturday, 500 empanadas on a Saturday, and then went to 1,000 plus empanadas on a Saturday. Now, after nearly two decades, Juan and Maria's empanada stop is moving. The building is set to be demolished as part of an $8 million renovation project at the market. Contreras says this location holds many fond memories. There's just so many stories that actually it's been suggested to me that I should write a book because it's just so many beautiful stories that uh, you can't make them up, basically. <laughs> Fortunately for Contreras and fans of his famous empanadas, the story doesn't end here. Juan and Maria will be opening at a different location right here at the public market. And Contreras says after nearly 30 years of perfecting his empanadas, he wants to spend more time with his family and expand the business. I want to, uh, you, know, you know, people to know that, you know, we really, we really need to start growing the brand, but through others that have been successful and they have maybe several uh, spots, uh, restaurants, let's say, with the outskirts of the city or the out, you know, the, in the suburbs. And that suits Bobby Padilla just fine. Good luck to Juan and in moving into his uh, next location and uh, future success. Juan and Maria's new location is expected to be at the main north entrance beginning next week.